Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda um, Oracle of Seasons with Mio Xfu and I want to apologize again for an improperly ended video. I don't like doing that, but you know what? I died and I realized I was at like 15 minutes for my recording, so... You got an improperly ended video! What you gonna do? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so we've visited all of the rooms. Oh, I guess they're just all skulls or something? That almost looks like a helmet now. Helmet and helmet. Or a penis. Um, I mean a helmet. <laughs> anyway. What am I, eight? <laughs> oh, only one person is gonna get that joke. I know exactly who she is. <laughs> Alright, so anyway, we need to go back here, because we have a boss door to open. Oh, shoot. With robes. Why, why are you in my face and all up in my grill? <laughs> Actually, I think we just go down here and this brings us straight to the boss door? Yes, it does! Alright, so we get to face a boss. Who could it be? <gasps> oh, you guys! Haha! <laughs> I know how to deal with you guys. So, you're gonna see I'm using bombs because, like I said a few dungeons ago, bombs do absolute amazing damage in this game. They do in every Zelda game, and they're just not used as much as they should be. Plus, by using the bombs, I don't have to even deal with this guy. <laughs> like, honestly, if I was using the sword, I'd be down six hearts right now, because that's how much I suck at using the sword against bosses and enemies. But, by just using, um, the bombs, I'm able to just stay away from him. And I can afford to have some amount of inaccuracy with how I'm placing these bombs, too. And, honestly, if I was using the slingshot, I'd s just suck as just, just as much. And actually, no, I am sucking right now because I'm paying more attention to throwing the bombs than I- Ow. Than I am looking for the fireballs. Ow. I think what you have to do, actually, is hit his head while they're flying. I might be wrong. It's been a while since I fought these guys. <laughs> I'm sure you all understand. I'll meet you back at the boss room. How about that? Okay, let's try this again. There's no way I'm gonna beat him. I'll try using the shield, I guess. No. Nope. See, that was just a waste of time. Ow! Hmm. Shoot. Yeah, I wasn't able to pick up enough bombs to actually be of any use. It, no, that won't do anything either. I think I can use the boomerang for any use. No, nope, that's not gonna do anything. That's not gonna do anything. <sighs> okay, at least I can do that. See, I'm already, I'm already screwed at this point. Alright, what I'm trying to do is get some sort of timing now, so I can hit him and fly away, fly away home like a goose, but it's not working. Come back here, fairy. I need to eat your head. For your beautiful life juices! Your succulent life energies will give me hearts, and I will be able to fight the horrible dragon beast and bring light, peace, and joyfulness back to the land of. 
Holodrum. With you, Mr. Fairy, although you're a missus, are not sticking around, and I cannot drink your life juices. Hello, Mr. Fairy. Maybe you will let me drink your life juices so that I will be nice and strong and ready to take on the evil in the world. Alright, ready? Oh, shoot. Oh, hey, we dodged it. Um, let's go again. Alright, so let's try to get that pattern down. Ow. Ooh, that was actually very nice. Uh, completely unintentional, but that was pretty cool. Got two heads in one shot. Double headshot! Just start speaking like that more often. That was actually pretty fun to do. We got. Okay, we got. Aha! No. Come on. Aha! <laughs> Ow. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay. Hit. Jump. Hit. Charge, charge away home, fly away home, like a goose, like a goose, like a moose, like the alcohol is being the boost, boost, who's the boost to get through, bomb, 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 okay, I'm actually quite frightened of this guy right now, um, if you look at him, that's actually one of the scariest bosses we've had to go against, he's just... A construct made of bones, like the bones of many organisms just piled together. But we beat him! We've only got three hearts left to go. Anyway, what do we beat? We have the holy ball sack! Anyway. Again, what am I eight? <laughs> well, you did get the seed of life. So. It's suggestive picture might actually speak of its real nature. If you know what I'm saying, nudge nudge wink wink, he said knowingly. You got the seed of life, an essence of nature. Life, spe life begins anew when birds carry this. The seed of life. Wink. To new lands. Exoticism, eh? Da -da -da, you got a new essence, da 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 la 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 Alright, and then I get to do my bad Meku tree. <gasps> Alex! How's it going? <gasps> Say, Alex! The seed of life has given my new strength! Now for the last essence of nature! Wow, the last one already? Huh. But this time, I saw no dreams! So I rely on you, Alex! It's somewhere in Holodrum! Good luck! Thanks to you, my strength is returning! Good luck again, Alex! Actually, to be fair... Mr. Maku Tree, it's not actually in Holodrum, it's somewhere beneath Holodrum. Hmm. Now what could that be? In fact, I think you might be able to guess because I don't think any of you are stupid. <laughs> um <laughs> What was that? Um <laughs> Uh I do not remember how we get that heart piece up above, but I want to find out before we go on. Because I'm pretty sure that it has something to do with this. This chimney right here. But I can't remember quite what. So let me go down and check real quick. Aha! A Meku Nut! Er, yeah, a Gasha Nut. What's inside? Better have been a ring. If you gave us like a heart or rupees, I would have flipped a sh flipped a table, flipped a flipped a microphone, flipped a recording, or something. Excuse me, Mister, but you can't park your car here because I was in a war. Okay, yeah. Anyway, let's go change that season to fall. Um, which it is currently now here, where I live. I know you're saying, but Alex, it's not September 21st. I'm like, well, so what? 
doesn't mean it can't be fall. I mean, we had our first fall day about a week ago, and today is our second fall day. And you're also gonna be like, but that makes no sense. There's like, seven days in between, you idiot. I'll be like, so? It, what, it felt like a day of fall. So to me, <laughs> that's the first day of fall. And then there were like five days of summer, and then another day of fall. That's all I care about. Don't care about your fancy calendars. <laughs> uh, what am I going on about? Absolutely, I have no idea. Anyway, like I was saying, we can now do this. Do stuff like this, and go up here. And it is fall, and we can pick those mushrooms and eat them, and die because they were poisonous. And... look at that. They just disappear. They're just a figment of our imagination. They must definitely be regular shrooms. So, collect. we need four more heart pieces. That's it. Because the last dungeon is gonna give us a our last heart container. And... Well, like I said, we only need four more heart pieces. And I know where I think... I think Maple actually is carrying one around with her, so we're gonna have to find her. Which, let's actually put on our Maple Ring. She should show up. Nope, okay. Aha! She should show up. Alright, let's get these out. Oh no, I want my sword. Let's see if she's actually changed her equipment. Aha! There we go! So she is now. Sabrina, the Teenage Witch, carrying her vacuum cleaner. <laughs> we meet again, you know the drill. Fastest one wins. Ready? Go! But yes, she's now Sabrina, the Teenage Witch, cruising around on her little vacuum cleaner. Ah, you! I'll remember this! <laughs> Um, I'm just trying to think before. Because ultimately, I want to run into Maple a couple of more times. Which means I need to kill 15 more enemies. Which I was already a good four. Um, before we get going, I think we can get a heart piece and a gasha nut. I think there's one up in Goron Mountain, which we weren't able to get yet because we did not have the cape. And... I have no idea where the last one is. <laughs> uh, we actually do have quite a few trees that we can check to to get some rings. Uh, actually, wait a minute. You should have other stuff now, shouldn't you? Yeah, we get the member's card, don't worry. I think you should. No, you still just have the Gasha Nuts. Uh, Gasha Seeds. Uh, okay. Yeah, so I have no idea where that last heart piece is. Um... If you have an idea, leave it in the comments! You can't see, but I have a huge grin on my face because that means I get a comment, too. <laughs> it's just a praise. Blast ring, bomb damage is up. Would have been helpful. We use it more. Uh, power ring level 1, sword damage up, uh, damage taken up. Which is absolutely useless for me because I am horrible at dodging. So I would just be dying all the time. Alright, so. Oh, you know what? I don't... I'm gonna end it here. Just, it might be short. I have no idea how long this episode is, but I'm gonna end it here. And next episode, I think actually I'm gonna go around and check for heart pieces and check for some seed rings and where we left our gasha nuts. Sounds like a good plan to me. So I will see you guys next time. On Let's Play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons with me, Oaks Foo. <laughs> doggy, 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 give me your ball. My dog's name is Flash! He's good at fetching! <laughs> I'm gonna 
See you guys. Oh, sorry. Take it easy. <laughs>